Understanding the differences between a shunt, dead space, and VQ mismatch is crucial in the field of respiratory care, as these concepts play a significant role in the efficiency of gas exchange in the lungs. And that is the topic of this video, so keep watching if you want to learn more. A shunt occurs when there is blood flow through the lungs without adequate gas exchange. This can occur due to blood passing through an anatomical shunt, where there is no alveolar ventilation, or through a physiological shunt, where the alveoli are inadequately ventilated. In either case, blood returns to the left side of the heart without being properly oxygenated. This situation is particularly problematic, because the oxygen content in the blood remains low despite increases in the inspired oxygen concentration. Shunts are often seen in conditions like pneumonia, where parts of the lungs are filled with fluid, or in congenital heart diseases where there is abnormal connection between the left and right sides of the heart. Dead space, on the other hand, refers to areas of the lungs where there is ventilation but no perfusion. Essentially, air reaches these parts of the lungs, but there is no blood flow in the adjacent capillaries to receive the oxygen. This is often described as wasted ventilation, because the oxygenated air is not used for gas exchange. Dead space increases in conditions like a pulmonary embolism, where a blood clot blocks the pulmonary artery, preventing blood flow from reaching parts in the lungs. VQ mismatch is a broader term that encompasses both shunts and dead space. It represents any disparity between ventilation and perfusion. Ideally, ventilation and perfusion should be matched to optimize gas exchange. However, various conditions can disrupt this balance. For instance, in chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, some alveoli may be overventilated but underperfused, while others may be well perfused but poorly ventilated, leading to a VQ mismatch. The severity and impact of the VQ mismatch depend on the extent and distribution of the affected areas. But as previously mentioned, while a shunt, dead space, and VQ mismatch all represent disturbances in lung function, they differ fundamentally in their mechanisms. A shunt is a problem of perfusion without adequate ventilation, dead space is an issue of ventilation without adequate perfusion, and a VQ mismatch is a broader concept that includes any imbalance between ventilation and perfusion encompassing both shunts and dead space. Understanding these distinctions is important for diagnosing and treating various respiratory conditions effectively. If you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it. There should be some other helpful videos popping up on your screen right about now that I think you will enjoy. And just a quick reminder, we are not doctors. This video is for informational purposes only. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed day, and as always, breathe easy, my friend.